Hey, what's up, Aaron here? Hope you're doing well. If you're watching this video right now, you might be checking out this uh, little website right here called Whatnot, and maybe you're wondering, is this legit? Can you really make money from Whatnot, or is this a big waste of time? Let's check it all out, all right? Now, if you wanna get to $10,000 a month, 100% from home, just go ahead and click the link below. I'll share with you my favorite strategy if you would like. On this channel, I have reviewed literally hundreds and hundreds of different strategies to make money online. Some of them are really good, some of them are so-so. A lot of them, though, are a big waste of time. So let's check out Whatnot to find out what this is really about how can you make money from whatnot and is this a good way to you know generate income or maybe there are better strategies out there okay now whatnot is a basically a live commerce website okay so it's kind of like TikTok shop right where people go live on TikTok and they sell items it's very very similar it's actually smaller than uh, TikTok shop and and you know going live selling commerce on TikTok but it is still pretty decent okay now the thing about whatnot is that it's only available in, in you know certain countries okay so it's available in the United States it's available in Canada in the UK, France, and Germany. That's it. Only these five places. So if you're not located in these five places, you're not going to be able to sell on whatnot. Just understand that. So that's really, really important, okay? Now, if you're not in those markets, stick around till the end of the video. I'll show you another strategy where you can use to still make money online. But um, whatnot is still a cool platform, right? So this is how it works, okay? If you've got stuff to sell, now generally it's cool if you sell, you know, things that are really interesting, things like your toys, collectibles, cards, figurines, things like that. But you can sell things as simple as shoes as well, like really cool sneakers, collect, you know, clothes, collectibles, stuff like that, right? People sell all sorts of stuff on here, but if you have things that are really interesting, things that are very unique, things that pop, I think it's actually easier to sell on Whatnot, right? So this is how it works. You come to whatnot.com, you click on become a seller, okay? And once you um, click on there, basically you can click on apply to sell. It's gonna take two weeks to get approved. That's the only thing, all right? They don't approve, they don't approve you instantly. It's a two week approval process, right? Um, and you can you know start selling and generating money that way. Now, on the website, it says that you know, on average, we see sellers that sell over $6,000 per month. Now, okay, let's be very, very clear, right? You are not going to generate $6,000 per month. That's going to take a long time. It will take you at least six to 12 months to even get anywhere close to that. And you have to also understand, it just depends on what kind of seller you are. If you're just an average person that doesn't own like a sneaker shop, or you don't have like a toy, you know, collection in your house, right? You're just selling random stuff, then, you're not going to get to this level because it requires you to sell a lot of stuff on that platform, all right? So generally, the people that do really, really well on this platform are people that have a lot of stuff to sell. So that means they already have some sort of store, they, you know, maybe they're a Lego collector and they're trying to offload a lot of their Lego. Maybe they've got a lot of like, you know, Batman figurines, Star Wars figurines that they're trying to offload. Maybe they own a sneaker shop, right? These are the people that tend to do really, really well on this particular platform. Now, it doesn't mean that you can't if you're just an individual normal person, but you have to have stuff to sell. If you don't have things to sell, then you're not really gonna do very well on this platform, okay? Now let's talk about how this actually works, all right? So first of all, you gotta get approved. It's gonna take you two weeks to get approved. You need inventory, right? See, do you have inventory, okay? Do you have a good social following? Do you have a history of selling? All of these things help for you to get approved. That's why it takes a little bit of time, okay? The next thing is, is you're going to host a show, and that's the thing about what not. It is a show. Okay, it's entertainment. So if you go on there and let's just say you've got, I don't know, you're gonna sell, you know, like your iPhone and stuff like that, you don't necessarily have to show your face. There are people that just kind of do videos like that where they just kind of show the phone or the item and stuff like that. But the people that do really well are the people that entertain. The people that get out there and say, hey, how's it going? My name's Aaron and I've got a cool little, you know, gadget right here. You know, this is how it works by here, right here. And you make it really, really fun, like a real show. These are the people that actually do really, really well because it's a social media platform. People wanna come here, be entertained, and buy stuff at the same time, okay? So there are a few different ways you can buy it, you know, sell it, you can make it like an auction, so the, the, the person that offers you the highest amount of money can, you know, gets the sale, uh, or you can just say, you know, buy it right now, and they just press buy and stuff like that, or people can bid. So there's multiple ways that, that you can do this. 
as soon as someone buys, you can grab a prepaid uh, whatnot shipping label, which is really cool, okay? So you don't have to pay for shipping, which is why you have to be in the right country, all right? So if you're not in these countries right here, US, Canada, UK, France, or Germany, then you can't post the items. And that's also why you have to be in the right countries to do this. But basically, you just slap the label on uh, and then you just um, put it in the mail, right? And then they pay you through PayPal or direct deposit. That's also why um, it's only available in, in certain countries because they can only manage those countries right now at this particular time, okay? So it's pretty cool, all right? Um, so let's talk a, a, a about you know some of the logistics about how this works, right? You already know how you get paid. They pay you off 48 to 72 hours after your package has been delivered to the buyer. So actually it's really, really fast. PayPal, or ACH, which is mainly in the US, direct to your American bank account, okay? Everybody else, pretty much through PayPal. Shipping, okay, UP, USPS or a Canadian Post. What are the fees? This is important, okay? As a seller, you have to pay some fees, all right? So they pay 8% commission on the selling price of the item, and then 2.9% commissions of processing fee on the entire transaction, plus 30 cents of payment, okay? So essentially, it's basically 11% uh, that they take away from the selling price plus 30 cents. That's the way that you need to look at it. It's not bad, honestly. I mean, you know, th this is a selling platform. You get to leverage a lot of their community. So there's a lot of people on whatnot, all right? Um, so you can actually leverage their community here and you just pay them basically 11% and they, they do the posting and shipping for free. You just have to bring it to the post office or wherever you do your shipping and handling, okay? So it's pretty good, I think, all right? Um, when can you schedule a show? Anytime. What can you sell? You can sell anything, pretty much, okay? Trading cards, clothing, collectibles, but things like collectibles generally do really, really well, all right? That's, that's really important to understand. And that's pretty much it, okay? So, a couple of tips that, that you need to learn, right? How can you really do this? So, the first thing that you have to understand is that you need to be consistent, okay? So, if you do your first show, um, you're probably not gonna have that many viewers, but you need to do it consistently over time. I would do like a show every single day. That's how you get really good at this stuff, okay? Don't think that, you know, you're gonna do three shows and you're gonna make a lot of money. That's not how this works. You have to do, you know, one or two shows every day for a long period of time to build up a following. And of course, you have to be good at it as well. You've gotta be entertaining and have lots of energy. And the more that you do that, the more stuff that you're gonna sell. If you're boring and you just show the product, you don't show your face, you don't do some crazy stuff, which, I mean, if you watch some of these guys perform on whatnot, they're pretty crazy, okay? And But they make a lot of money that way, right? So it just depends on, on how you wanna do this, okay? So be consistent, build a following, entertain, um, you know, if you do decide not to show your face, then you still have to do some fun stuff, okay? Don't just like, you know, have no sound, don't have any words and just show it. Some people do that, you're not gonna make money that way, all right? You have to talk, you have to speak, you have to be dynamic. You don't necessarily have to show your face, but you gotta be fun and entertaining, okay? I hope that makes sense. And that's how you make the most money on whatnot. The other thing that I wanna mention as well is like I mentioned again, is that the people that do the best on this, I mean, they've, they've, got, they've got a lot of stuff to sell. I mean, look at, look at these right here, right? These people aren't regular people. They own stores. They've got a lot of collectibles, okay? They've got a lot of stuff to sell, and these are the people that do the best on here, right? So if you just have a couple of items to sell, you're probably not gonna make a lot of money on whatnot, all right? So you have to think about whether this is a good fit for your life and a good fit for what you're doing right now. If you've got a lot of stuff to sell, it's a great platform. If you don't have that much, if you just want like you just want to offload your iPhone, then whatnot is not the platform for you to do this. Okay, this is more like a business. If you somehow have access to a lot of great stuff that you want to sell, I hope that makes sense. And potentially, you can do really, really well if you're in the right markets and you entertain and you're consistent. All right. So if you want to check it out, whatnot.com. All right. Now, if you're here watching this video and you're like, well, Aaron, I want to make money online, and you know, but I'm not in any of these countries right here, or maybe you're not a big influencer, maybe you don't have a a lot of stuff to sell, maybe you don't have much inventory, then it, it's actually quite difficult to make money on whatnot, right? Um, now, on this channel, I have reviewed hundreds and hundreds of strategies to make money online. I've seen the good, the, the bad, and the ugly, but out of all the good strategies, there's one strategy that I used to quit my full-time job in 2019. I work full-time from home now, 
um, I generate five figures every single month. It changed my life, okay? I think this is a great strategy for any beginner, anybody that doesn't have any inventory, you have no experience, it's a great way to start generating income online. It changed my life, all right? If you wanna check out that strategy, click the link right at the bottom. I've got a free masterclass that will show you how to do that, all right? I hope you enjoyed this review of Whatnot. All the best to you, and I will see you on the next video review. Take care.